Chicken and dogs in the backyard. Chicken and dogs in the backyard. Chickens and dogs in the backyard. And sometimes we shoot a boat. Today's special holiday episode of Chicken and Dogs, we're featuring the chickens pecking away at a pile of peanuts. And the dogs trying to help them clean up the mess. How you doing? Uh, you know, I mean, it's... I don't know why. I, I, is it even safe for dogs to eat peanuts at all? Because, I mean, yeah. I don't know. The dogs eat everything here. From bird shit to chicken shit to coyote shit. I mean, pretty much anything that comes out of a animal's anus is what they eat. Nico, that's gross. I know. But like, it's true. Crazy. Disgusting, but... I don't know. And then, you know, that dog right there has a case of the hornies. Yeah, so he's been pretty much been doing this dog all day. The black dog, so yeah, but it's a nice warm day out here in the chicken and dog land. Uh -huh. The sun is shining, the birds are chirping, the chickens are pecking, and we're about to start the grill. We're gonna make some special dinner for the dogs. Since chicken gizzards. Yep, holiday edition chicken gizzards. I mean, I know it's not like Christmas or New Year's Eve, but what kind of holiday is it other than that, or is it like one of those? It's like New Year's. Oh, that's that's the New Year's. Basically, January. 3rd. Welcome 2021 to all our fans. So what do you look? What do you think? Look, the chickens are there, just pecking away, pecking away, pecking away. That one's missing a lot of feathers on its stomach. I wonder what happened. Look at that. Yeah, it's probably that gray dog corner. Yeah. Hope it doesn't kick the bucket on us. We're starting to get eggs again. Yeah. Oh, it looks like they're fighting for a peanut. Little chicken just trying to get a nut. He got it. Oh, he missed it. He fumbled it. He got it. Oh, they're going beak to beak. Oh, yeah, look at them. Look at them. They're pecking away. That is an indestructible peanut. That's old Mr. Peanut himself. Well, the other two chickens, they wandered off over there. They're off on their own. Let's go see what they're doing. These chickens have been alive like ever since 2017, bro. No, normally our chickens don't even live that long. I mean, they normally live for like one or two years and then they die. These ones are doing pretty good. They're pretty hardy. In yeah. February, we're gonna get another little bunch of chickens. We're gonna get four hands. Jeez, grandma's not gonna be happy about that. And then we're gonna get a mixed batch of where the chickens are, whatever you get is what you get. Hoping we'll get a rooster out of the deal. Yeah, also, fun fact, we, me and my grandfather have been actually planning to make this YouTube channel ever since 2018. And now it's finally come to fruition. We have 17 subscribers is what I hear. What yeah. do you think, Nicholas? How many we got? I, I would guess like 17 subs. I mean, I have a YouTube channel myself, but I recommend not sub to it. Don't sub to it if you don't like gory content or just video games in general. Well, let's go have one more look-see at the, at the little peckers over there. And then we'll call it good for this episode of Chicken and Dog. Oh, we should have shown, we could show our new, uh, our new weapons. Yeah, we got slingshots. We have some new weapons here. Yeah. Fight the zombies off. Critters. Yeah, he, yeah, my grandfather has some, like, plan for a zombie apocalypse. Like, he has a whole plan. Like, it's to the point where it, it's like a whole paper. Like, he has, like, locations, like, each location of the house, like, like, he has, like, rules for everybody. My role is a sniper. I'm pretty much just, yeah. He told me that, and this is it. <laughs> there we go. We're ready to go now for them zombies. What we've been shooting out of here is um, China Berries. They're very uniform in size and weight. They, they fly pretty good, and they're hard as a rock. Yeah, I was about to say that. Yeah. Nico shot me with one. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't that funny. Yeah. And it did sting a little. So now I gotta shoot him back. <laughs> <laughs> then that's life in chicken and dog. Yeah. Yeah, the reason why we haven't been posting a lot was mainly because so I moved into my great grandma's house where my mom lives because my mom said she feels a lot safer when I'm living with her. And you know, I mean since we got family over, my mom decided to move me back here with actually that was my decision to move back here with uh 
my grandfather, my grandma. And the so, dogs. And, and the chickens and the dogs. Yeah, so. I mean, I could have stayed at my auntie's house, but I don't know. I mean, there's nothing really fun over there. Except for the just, TV. Just the baby. There's a baby there. Yeah, there's a baby there, but. Here's a baby cry. Yeah, a little terrorist. Okay, well, I guess that's yeah. it for today's episode of Chicken and Dogs. Special holiday edition. I want to give a shout out to all my fans. All our fans out there. We got, oh, quite a few subscribers now. I don't yeah. want to mention any names but jade and anthony and courtney who else nicholas oh no yeah but anyway so yeah oh, also, we'll, we'll show them the chili look the chili was... also the reason why i moved back here was because uh i got family coming over for like new year's and all that i had to give up my room so yeah that's why i had to so i'm moving back here and here's a little chili garden right here chili the chickens garden. really like it they like to, eat, like to eat the peanuts off of this plant. They eat the chilies off of that one. But they That's won't true. eat the jalapenos. I mean, I ate a full jalapeno once. I mean, my mouth was burning, but it did taste good, though. And Damn, what happened to me? Like, I used to eat, like, two, jala two full jalapenos and no spice. But, like, I think California got you a little wimpy. Yeah. So we're going to have to jalapeno on up. Yeah, but living with my mom did make a man out of me. That's all I can say. Oh, that's good. Yeah. But anyway, so... Guess that'll be it for uh, chicken and dogs in the backyard. And sometimes we shoot our bows.